Toyota secured a maiden NASCAR Cup Series title in 2015, courtesy of Joe Gibbs Racing star driver Kyle Busch. It was just reward for JGR, who switched to the Japanese automaker back in 2008. Making headlines again, Joe Gibbs promoted 2016 Xfinity champion Daniel Suarez into the Cup competition for this year. He's the first Mexican-born driver to compete in a full Cup season. So far it's been very good. I've been I'm still learning a lot about the guys, about you know how to work, and it's just more going on in comparison with the Xfinity series. And as a driver, you get a lot of more information. You just get more stuff. The car has more power, less downforce, a little bit more technology. We have more engineers, more people working in the race car to make it faster. So it's a big step, maybe maybe one of the biggest steps of my racing career. But so far it's been working out very well. Uh, you know, the, the team has been working very hard to try to make that transition as smooth as possible. And I'm just excited, you know, excited to be here and I'm ready to go. Another rookie who has stepped up into the Premier category is Eric Jones, driving Furniture Row Racing's number 77 Toyota Camry. It's interesting to see how you move up through the ladder, um, but the competition level of the cup side is definitely the highest. It's a big step, you know, starting a brand new team over with Furniture Row, trying to figure everything out, get everybody into the right roles, and we're all working together, making adjustments, trying to make changes, trying to make our car better. Media ramps up, uh, the time you need to spend dedicated to the team and to the car, and time even not being at the track you need to spend dedicated to it ramps up. So all of them are all together a little bit higher, but that's what we all want to do. That's what we're all here for. We all wanted to race in the cup series, so. Uh, it's all things we kind of accept. The two rookies still participate in the NASCAR Xfinity Series alongside their cup commitments. They look up to 2015 cup champion Carl Busch, who defied all odds to give Toyota their first championship and who has also played a big part in Suarez's career. That's a big deal, you know, to just to start the season with, a, you know, with an accident and then you know, stay out for for a couple months and then come back and win races and then win the championship, that's, that's a big deal. That, that's something that uh, doesn't happen very often. And uh, to be friends and, uh, and to be able to, to share information and to ask for an advice, this is a big deal. This year, Toyota celebrates its 10th season in the sport. And even though Suarez and Jones will be racing for different teams, they'll both have Japanese power and reliability under the hood. You know, ever since they got into the sport, they really put 100% effort into it and in uh, the dedication and the people they have to make sure everything's going right is just, it's huge. So they've got great people. They've really led us in a direction that has made us a lot more successful, even since the time I've been in the sport since 2013. And it's been neat to see. It's, it's neat to get to know all these people and, uh, and see how they're leading us in the right direction. For me, it's, it's very good because I've been racing NASCA for seven years, counting the, the years in Mexico and here. And, and luckily, I've been with, with Toyota pretty much my entire career. And to be able to, to be fast, to win races and to win championships together. Full of youthful confidence, the two rookies will be hoping to take Toyota all the way to the chase and beyond. You know, you look at the Cup Series and it's definitely a challenging series, but I think we just want to improve all year and we want to be able to be contenders by the end of the year. And, we want to make the chase, we want to try to run up front, so we need to get all those things lined up and get better throughout the year. So as long as we're improving every week, you know, I think we'll be pretty happy with it all. I think to learn as hard as possible will be, will be the first goal. I think after that we, we're going to start to be you know, competitive. I need to be realistic. I know, I know I have the team capable to win races. I know I'm going to get to that point, but I need to be realistic and, and, and take everything step by step and, and try to run strong, try to have a, a good run without mistakes. You have to bring all, all these things together, but, uh, but so far I'm enjoying the ride a lot.